This game will be coming to you from the beautiful M&T Bank Stadium in Baltimore. Thanks for joining us tonight. Both of these teams hoping that their 13th game will be a lucky one for them as the Bears square off against the Ravens. They're lined up for the kickoff, so let's get this game started. Dorsey, he's just about ready to kick this one away. Number This one is handled by number 83. And they're ready to go on offense for the first time. John, for people who love defensive struggles, this game is exactly what they're looking for. Two of the best in the league out on the field today. These are two of the most talented defenses in the they'll league. Not only they'll can these the guys stop you from scoring, they yeah. can create scoring by themselves. Yeah, you're right. I wouldn't be surprised if this game turns on a big defensive play that generates points, like an interception return or a fumble recovery, something like that. Forest will be looking at second down now after that pass picks up five yards. Second and six coming up here. The Ravens come out in a nickel pack. Throwing. Right on target to the wide receiver. He gets the first down reception and then some. throw completed pass to the back and he is bumped out of bounds at the 36 yard line they throw it and pick up a second consecutive first down well when you start to establish something you want to keep it going until the defense finds a way to stop you ball on the 36 yard line Palmer the long back receives the handoff Joyce oh, is the there for the tackle one at the 36. When you run the ball in the first half, you're trying to keep the defense on it. But if you're only getting gains like that in the second half, then it puts more pressure on your passing second game. Ten. Ball on the 36-yard line. Yard line. From the start, from the start. You gotta have it, Palmer, the lone setback. Under pressure, throwing. Gross is there on the oh, stop the at the 33. Three Good play by the defense. Point. Rush the passer, and when you feel the screen, you turn and you go back down the line. Third, third down, seven. they need to get it to the 26 to convert. Forrest starts out of the shotgun. Dropping back, throws it. Kendall is there for the tackle at the 20. When you think about guys with great hands, he's very close to the top, John. I'll tell you what. He does a great job of using his hands and not letting the ball get into his body. He's worked very hard to improve his pass catching. But I think he's become one of the best out there. The defense lines up in the nickel. On the pull. Nice play fake. Gets rid of it. Nearly intercepted. Sherry was the intended receiver on that play. Eighth play of this drive. Ball on the 20 yard line. Give me ball. Only one man back. They give it to the hand back. Number 55 is there for the tackle at the 14. Up with a nice burst through the middle that time. Five yard pickup. So in third down, they'll be looking for a play that will get them to the 10. He tucks it away. Closing in and sack. Great job getting in there to drag the quarterback down. He picks up the sack. And he'll make two or three plays like that in just about every game. The 
Stewart, Stewart will put them in the lead if he makes this. The field goal kick sails through the uprights. Decent drive, turning their first possession into three points. And you want to get something on your first possession. They were looking for a touchdown, but the defense kind of tightened up. This one is taken by Mack. Baltimore trying to push this one all the way down the field for the lead. Right. Ball the on their own 20. Start the drive at the 20 yard line. First and 10. Let's go, boys. The Bears line up in a 4 3. Let's go. The rush is on with the throw. And he steps out of bounds at the 26-yard line. Look here. He does two things perfectly on this play. One, he watches the ball all the way into his hands to make the catch. And two, he shows great awareness and gets both feet down in bounds. <laughs> That's a nice-looking play. Play two quarters. Two quarters. Come on. Hey, watch that screen. Deuce it, deuce it. Let's do our thing. Let's do our thing. They ain't got nothing. Go make a play. They give it to the halfback. William is there for the tackle at the 30-yard line. It's important to pound the defense with a run. Sooner or later, they're going to bend. Ball on their own 30. Ball on the 30-yard line. Dig in, dude. Dig in. The Bears come out in a 4-3. He was hit just as he threw. Watch it here. He's getting pressure, but he's strong enough and mobile enough to get away from the rush and avoid the sack. Now, you need a quarterback who can do things like that because sometimes an incompletion can be a pretty good play. yard line. He lost it. The Bears. Oh, no. That was a lucky bounce. First Ball on their ten. own 28. Ball on the 28 yard line. Let's go now. He'll pass on first down. Pump fakes with the throw. Ooh, nearly picked off. They were in his own defense in perfect position to make the play. But they let it get away. Second and ten. Ball on the 28 yard line. Watch your eyes. Get it up. Bomber lines up behind his fullback in the eye. With the pass, almost picked off. The defender got in between the ball and the receiver again. The intended receiver on the play. Defense! Third and ten. Ball on the 28-yard line. Gotta keep our fours here. From the gun. Gets the pass off. He hits his receiver. Lopez comes up to make the play at the 35. Now, I don't know why you call a play that doesn't take your receiver past that first down marker. So they'll line up the punt after going three and out. And he signals for the fair catch. Fair catch made at the 22 yard line. It's first and ten. Start the drive at the 22 yard line. First and ten. 
Chicago comes out in a 4-3. Dropping back to pass on first down. Throws it. Smith is there for the tackle. What a throw. He put everything he had into that one. Ball on their own 43. Ball on the 43 yard line. Pressure, looking for the long completion. What an effort. They're going to spot this one at the 15-yard line. So they get two first downs on their last two plays. And they're getting it done by seeing the whole field and taking what the defense gives them. First and 10. Ball on the 15-yard line. I'm coming through, baby. Chicago lines up in a 4-3. With the counter play, Nelson created problems in the backfield on that one, and he chases him down behind the line of scrimmage for a loss. I'll tell you, he's one of the most knowledgeable defenders in the league. He knows how to play the game, and he always knows what's going on. They're in the red zone. Ball on the 17 yard line. Come on! Hey, let's go one team. So they're now inside the 20 and down by three. Cross play to the right. Stiff arms the defender to the ground. Wicked with the stop at the 16-yard line. I'll tell you, if you want to run outside the tackles, you have to seal off the inside and kick out the outside to have some kind of hole to run through. That just didn't happen on that play. Third down now, and the five-yard line is where they have to reach. Here we go. Danny, Danny, Danny. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Chicago comes out in the quarter defense. Throws it. This pass is incomplete. That short pass on third down fails. Meyer can tie it up here with a field goal. Good. The key to winning is having your drives get some sort of points for your team. They got it done on that drive. And I'm sure they're thinking touchdown for their next one. Dorsey looks like he's just about ready to kick this one off. Number 83. Good distance. This one is taken by number 83. On their last drive, it was three plays and out, and now the offense comes out onto the field once again. Ball on their own 20. Start the drive at the 20 yard line. First and 10. it off. Gross is there for the tackle. You got to keep going to the run. You never know when there's going to be a great blocking ahead of you, allowing for a big one right into the end zone. Second and three. Ball on the 27 yard line. Here we go. Watch the snap now. There you go, Here we go, baby. Rock and roll. Throws it. It's broken up. That's just great positioning by the defender. He has his eyes in the backfield the whole time, and he was right there to break the play up. Jones was his intended target. Third and three. Ball on the 27-yard line. Watch the man. Don't stop. Don't stop that motor. Nickelback in this time. Gets the pass off. Incomplete. Good defense and three and out series are the way to keep your defense fresh and rested. Matt, back to return.
They'll spot this one where it went out. Ball on their own 35. Ball on the 35 yard line. Chicago goes with a four man front on the call. Number 60 is there for the tackle at the 36. The defensive tackle surged through the line to bring the runner down. Second and nine. Ball on the 36 yard line. Let's go, Beatles! It's showtime, baby. The Bears with a four man front. Handed off to the back. Great fake. Going deep. He made the catch. Touchdown, Ravens. The quarterback went through his progression and found a receiver that he thought had the best chance to haul it in for the score. comes in for the extra point. The extra point attempt is good. Baltimore has a one touchdown lead now. Dorsey will be kicking off. Number 83. This one is taken by number 83. It's still very early, but this is one of those spots where you'd like to be able to respond and put the ball in the end zone. Ball on their own 20. Start the drive at the 20 yard line. First and 10. The Ravens come out with three down linemen and seven defensive backs. And he makes the grab. Mitchell is there on the stop at the 28-yard line. I like the quick decision by the quarterback. The defense didn't have time to react. Second and two. Ball on the 28-yard line. Palmer, the lone setback. Watch your eyes. Throwing. And he goes out of bounds at the 32 yard line. We get first down yardage on that hookup. Ball on their own 32. Ball on the 32 yard line. We've reached the end of the first quarter, and the score is 10-3. Ravens. The Bears. And we're ready to start the second quarter. Ball on their own 32. Ball on the 32-yard line. Let's go. This side, From the gun. Pass play here on first down. Deep throw. Almost intercepted. The, the defender makes a good play to break up the deep pass. Yeah, he had great coverage, but the ball should have ended up in his hand, not on the turf. Second and ten. Ball on the 32-yard line. Come on! The Ravens come out of the quarter defense. They'll bring the blitz. He finds his man. Lopez is there for the tackle. The defense blitzes the corner, but the quarterback got rid of it quickly for a completion and a first down. That was a great play because he saw him coming, remained calm, and threw an accurate pass. Ball on their own 49. Ball on the 49-yard line. No more, fella. Under 10, 10. Forrest scans the defense from the gun. Gets rid of it. 
Andrews comes up to make the play. A successful offense is one that can run and throw for good yardage on first down. About seven yards there. Ball on the 43-yard line. Hey, watch the ball. Baltimore comes out in their nickel pack. Spins away. Number 55 is there on the stop at the 39-yard line. The Bears are handling the defense right now. They haven't even had a third down in this drive. First and 10. Ball on the 39-yard line. Stay at home. Danny, Danny, Danny. Tucks it away. Jackson comes up to make the play at the 33-yard line. And now our viewers can see how successful each team's main running threat has been today. Ball on the 33-yard line. Ball on the 33-yard line. Hey, let's go. Tampa. it out to the left. Dropped in the backfield for a short loss. You know, Johnny always seems to be in perfect position to make a play. He's all about effort. His motor's always running at 100%, and he's got the experience to diagnose plays very quickly. On third down, they have to get it to the 29-yard line for a first down. Fires this one deep. Incomplete pass. If it was shot at the end zone, it doesn't work. Fourth down now. Stewart will have to get all of this one. It's good. It's good. That kick will go right through, giving him his second field goal of the night. He got all of it, and it sails out of the end zone. The defense looks to rebound after that last effort when they allowed a touchdown. First and ten. Ball on the 20-yard line. Get it up! Chicago comes out in a 4-3. Let's go now! He tucks it away. Nelson is there on the stop at the 22-yard line. The defense held their positions and didn't let him get very far. Gain of two. Second and eight. Ball on the 22-yard line. Chicago goes with a four-man front. Watch out. There we go, baby. Rock and roll. Pressure coming with the pass. Gets his hand on it. He has to do a better job of looking off the coverage before he makes a throw like that. Zimmer was the one they were trying to get the ball to. Third and eight. Ball on the 22-yard line. Finley starts out of the shotgun. Rose it. This pass is incomplete. I'll tell you, the defense made a great stand right there. Dorsey is ready to punt this one away. Number 83 will go back to accept this punt. From the 38 yard line. <laughs> 
The first and ten. Will start the drive at the 43-yard line. First and ten. Left, left. Uh, going to the left. Uh, this one will be spotted at the 41. He got in there and made the tackle for his fourth of the game. Good job knifing in there to bring him down. He brings a lot of things to the table. But the thing I like the most is how prepared he always is. I mean, he can run and he can tackle. And he watches so much tape that he actually anticipates what the offense is going to run before they call the play. The Ravens come out with three down linemen, seven defensive backs. And it's intercepted. He didn't look off the defender, and that's why they'll be coming off the field. After the interception, they'll set up shot at the 47-yard line. The Bears come out in a 4-3. Fresh throw. Dead ball. Let's start on the offense. Number 66. Number 66. Moved a little early there. Yeah, the rule for the offensive line is once you put your hand down, you can't move First until the 15. ball snaps. Ball on the 42-yard line. Get it, Sean. Let's go. Be good. Hand off to the tailback. Spins away from the tackle. Barrett is there on the stop at the 43. He was not going to be denied the first down there, John. I'll tell you, this is a special player, and he can make you look bad. First and 10. Ball on the 43 yard line. Danny, Danny, Danny. Here we go. What's green? Chicago goes with a four man front. No pass on first down. Gets the pass off, and the catch is made. Win gets the reception, but it's only about a two-yard pickup. On the play. Second and eight. Ball on the 41-yard line. Under 10, 10. Chicago using three linebackers. Hand off on the draw. Quick is there on the stop at the 39-yard line. Right now, they need to keep going at the defense with a run. Sooner or later, they'll be able to break one for a big game. Third down, and the spot they'll have to reach for a first is the 33. The Bears come out in a nickel package. Everything you got. Let's turn it up, D. Cross play to the right. Spotted at the 37. He records his third tackle of the game. So let's take a look at how this back compares to the opposition. Number 83. Looks like he's ready for the return. Fair catch. the 34 and it's good for a first down first and 10 ball on the 34 yard line watch your eyes the ravens come out of the nickel pack deep throw Drops the interception Doss was the intended receiver on that play and was there on the coverage Second and ten. Ball on the 34-yard line. Get it up! Get it going! Palmer, the deep back. Forrest with a man in motion. Danny, Danny, Danny! With a counter play. Number 55 comes up to make the play at the 33-yard line. He always displays great awareness, and he gets in there and brings him down for a loss. I'll tell you, he might be one of the smartest linebackers in the NFL right now. 
He anticipates, closes, and boom. He drags the ball carry down for a loss. The defense lines up in the nickel. Under pressure. They brought an all-out blitz, John, and took him down for the loss. They get pressure on him from all angles. He didn't have a chance. into the game for the punt. Matt is the deep return man. And he chooses not to return this one. Fair catch made at the 29-yard line. Right. First and ten. will start the drive at the 29-yard line. First and ten. Finley gains the defense from the gun. Looking for something long. He's there for the catch. I've watched this guy play, and I think that's the kind of thing he does best. He reads the defense quickly, finds a single coverage, and lets it fly. He's willing to go long on any down in any situation, so the defense can't afford to be too aggressive out there. First and ten. Ball on the 18-yard line. The last red zone trip resulted in a field goal. With a counter play. Dropped in the backfield for a short loss. Now let's have a look at what our runners have done up to this point. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 18 yard line. What's the hard count? The Bear with a four-man front on the call. Strickland is the air on the stop at the 19. They've had a tough time establishing a running game so far. This front seven is doing a heck of a job of shutting down the running lane. So on third down, they'll be looking to get it to the eight-yard line or further. Dropping back for the end zone. Caught. Touchdown, Ravens. This is an option route. The receiver's route depends on the defense he sees. But the quarterback has to see the same thing to make it work. Here, they're both on the same page, and they get a touchdown. The point after is good. Big players make big plays, and that scores touchdowns. Give some credit to the linemen out there. They're the biggest guys in the field, and without them, no one gets into the end zone. Dorsey Baltimore is back is and ready to put this one in the air. Back to this one is taken by number 83. The Bears will have to hurry it up as they start the drive at the 20-yard line. First it's and first ten. and ten. Ball on the 20-yard line. The defense lines up in the nickel. Launches this one to the left. Johnson makes the catch. He fights off the defender to make the catch for a big game. You know what this does? It keeps one defense on the field. And it doesn't let them get the right personnel in there somehow. We're at the one-minute mark. Ball on the 43-yard line. 
The Ravens come out in a dime package. Going to the air on first down. Closing in. Can't get it away. The offense calls a timeout. They need some better blocking out of that offensive front. You have to use your hands, get them out in front of you, keep them inside, maintain leverage, and balance it. You need to hold those Second blocks and slow down the pass rush. Ball on the 50-yard line. Yeah, go! Here we come. Watch your man. Under 10, 10. One of us gonna make a play. Play hard and fast, baby. Blitz is coming. Throws this one away. He didn't want to risk an interception and decides to throw it away. Third and long, the defense trying to bring this drive to a halt. Third and long, ball on the 50-yard line. I think this defense looks forward to these third down situations because they've been stopping them today. Gets the pass off. Andrews comes up to make the play at the 40-yard line. Good tackle by the cornerback, stopping him from getting a first down. Will come in now to punt it away. Matt lines up deep for the punt return. He's waving for the fair catch. Now this is a big time play by the special team. The punter does his job and he puts it where the returner can't catch it. And the coverage team does their job by getting in position to knock it back into the field and pin him inside the 10. The backs are lined up in an eye. Hey, watch the ball. Get Gets the call. Keeps his feet moving. Sarah is there on the stop at the 13-yard line. Sarah is getting up very slowly. It looks like he'll head toward the sideline and we'll get you an injury report as quickly as possible. And this should be the last play of the half. Hold the look. Emmanuel is the deep back. It's on. Uh -huh. All right, let's go. Uh -huh. Ain't no thing. Let's uh -huh. go, boys. Let's go. One more, fellas. Uh -huh. We got to believe in this all day. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Let's do our thing. Let's do our thing. What's the hard count? Uh -huh. Here we go. Uh -huh. Let's go. Yeah, it's on. Uh -huh. Blue game, blue game. Uh -huh. Bring it up! Bring it up! Here I go! Go uh -huh. make a play! Hot temper! Watch this! Hot! All right, here we go! Play! Hot! Play! He hands it off. Number 36 comes up to make the play at the 17-yard line. At the end of two, the score is 17-6. Ravens. The Bears. As we take a look at his success returning kicks, we get ready for the kickoff. Pat comes in to kick off. This one is fielded by Matt. Baltimore is looking to extend its advantage as they take over again offensively. First, First and ten. ten. Oh, With the pass, and he makes the grab. Williams. 
is there on the stop. Finley leads the pass, good pickup, about seven yards. Ball on their own 27. A report now on the injured player the team is indicating it's the type of injury that will take some time to heal, so he is done for the day. Tucks it away. Whitfield is there for the tackle. Excellent run for a first down. They brought some extra heat with a blitz, but he was able to find some room and pick up the first. So they have first and ten here. The Bears come out in a 4-3. With the throw, this pass is incomplete. Johnson was his intended target. Number 27 had the coverage on the play. Second and ten. Ball on the 30 yard line. Nickelback in this time. Dropping back. Pressure. Gets the pass off. He appeared to feel the pressure there. So many passing attacks in the NFL rely on timing. When you can put pressure on the passer, you never give him a chance to get into a rhythm. And you force him to throw the ball before he wants to. Third and ten. Ball on the 30-yard line. The Bears come out in a nickel pack. The rush is on. Going deep. Not the way. Well, that's just the kind of play they've come to expect from him. He always seems to make the big play just when they need him to. Zimmer was the one they were trying to get the ball to. Dorsey is ready to pump this one away. Number 83 into return. Fair catch called for. Fair this is where you want to respond quickly, or this could turn into a battle for field position. First Ball on their 10. own 29. Ball on the 29 yard line. Forrest starts out of the shotgun. Gets rid of it. The wide receiver has it. Kendall comes up to make the play. He found a soft spot in the coverage, John. The receiver did a great job reading the coverage. He found a hole in the zone, and the quarterback found him in that hole with the pass. Second and one. Ball on the 38 yard line. They'll bring the blitz. Pressure coming. On the move. Incomplete. Number 83 was the intended receiver on that play. The intended receiver on the play. So as they get set to try to convert, here's what both teams have done on third down. The offense has had trouble moving the sticks on third down so far. With the throw. Kendall is there for the tackle at the 49-yard line. And so a risky call to send the corner backfires, and they give up a first down. Some quarterbacks love blitzing corner because they know that there's one less cover man out there and have a lot better shot at hitting someone's stride. Gives the ball off. Play action. Throwing. He can't stay in bounds. I think the quarterback just let that one get away. Jones was his intended target. Second and ten. Ball on the 49 yard line. Defense, get ready. The Ravens come out in a nickel pack. They're coming with the blitz. Throws on the move. Pass falls incomplete. And they were each jockeying for position while that one was in the air. Pass on the defense. On the defense. On the first down. First down. This one goes against the defender. Both the offensive and the defensive player have a right to go for the ball there. But it looks as though the defender just decided to tackle the receiver 
rather than play in the pass. First and ten. Ball on the 33-yard line. The counter play pushes over. Joyce created problems in the backfield on that play. So after that run, we can see how the two main threats on the ground have fared so far. Ball on the 36-yard line. Ball on the 36-yard line. You got to leave it. It's our day. Save it up. Watch out. Let's go. Not today. Dropping back. Gets the pass off. And it's complete. Irvin is there for the tackle at the 32-yard line. Number 83 makes the catch but doesn't get very far. And that's what the mark of a solid defense is. They close in on you in a hurry, and they don't miss tackle. It's third down, and they have to get it to the 23 to convert. They ain't got nothing. Baltimore comes out in their nickel package. Here they come. Throws it. Pass falls incomplete. And he throws incomplete because he had major pressure. The corner came on a blitz, and he sprinted for the quarterback. Guys love the opportunity to get a sack. And that time, he just missed taking him down. They have a field goal here brings them within a touchdown. The field goal is good. kicks it is good. He's one of those guys who really works hard at what he does. And you can see that hard work paying off when you make a kick like this one. This one is handled on that. Following a punt on their last drive, the offense now makes its way back out onto the field. First it's and first ten. and ten. Ball on the 20 yard line. The Bears come out in a nickel package. Under pressure. Long throw. What a catch. Mohammed is there on the stop at the 36-yard line. He's having one of his best games out there. He's caught just about everything thrown at him. First and ten. Ball on the 36-yard line. Here we go, baby. Rock and roll. Do something, do something. The Bears line up in a 4-3. Gets rid of it. It's broken up. Pass on the parents, on the defense, and the 49. So he pays for down. his aggressiveness. Yeah, the defender has to be careful to make sure he plays the ball rather than the receiver. First and 10. Ball on the 26 yard line. Watch the snap down. Set. Gets the pass off. He hits his receiver. Wick is there for the tackle. That's why he's so dangerous. I'll tell you what. He's just a football player and a great ball handler. Anytime you get the ball in his hands, it can be big. First they need 10, 10 for a score. Ball on the 10 yard line. Will, Will, Will. Let's turn it up, D. On the 10. The last time they were down here, they scored a touchdown. Hey, watch the screen. Hey, watch the ball. Throwing. Oh, man, he had it in the end zone, but dropped it. One person breathing a sigh of relief is the quarterback. Second and ten. Ball on the ten-yard line. Play football. The Bears line up in a 4-3. Everything you got. Come on. They give it to the halfback. Peterson is there on the stop at the four-yard line. Emmanuel kept his legs moving, gets seven hard-earned yards. Right. 
Just four yards from the goal line now. Closing in. Throws one up in the end zone. Touchdown, Ravens. The veteran tight end holds it in for six. He does a great job here of avoiding the jam at the line of scrimmage and giving his quarterback a window in the end zone. Myers comes in to attempt the point after. The extra, the extra point, point attempt, attempt is good. good. Football is all about trusting your teammates to make good decisions out there in the heat of the battle. When you can do that, everybody starts firing on all cylinders, and you can come up with drives like the one we just saw. Dorsey looks like he's just about ready to kick this one off. This one is fielded by number 83. Been a rough start to this game, but they still have enough time to turn it around. Ball on their own 20. Start the drive at the 20 yard line. First and 10. Out of the eye formation. Forrest sends a man in motion. Forces it out to the left. Clears the defender. Williams comes up to make the play at the 22 yard line. Mixon runs with passes, keeps the defense on. Gain of three. It's second down and eight to go. Gives the ball off. Number 55 is there on the stop at the 28. The best backs in the league average four to five yards a carry. But there are a lot of things that go into a successful running game. You got to have good play calling, good blocking up front, and a back that can take advantage when he sees the opening. So that's a gain of about five. This team has to start converting on third down if they're going to be successful. Runs for the tackle. Mitchell is there for the tackle at the 41-yard line. They blitz and it backfire. Yeah, that's a chance you take. You're hoping to get some penetration and hit him in the backfield. But if you miss, there isn't a lot of help at the next level to keep him from picking up the first down. All on the 41-yard line. Only one man back. Only the counter play. Gross comes up to make the play at the 48-yard line. The move the change again after another long gain on the ground. You no, know, I was talking to the coach the other day, and he said he wanted to emphasize the run a little more. And that's exactly what we're seeing. Ball right around midfield. Only one man in the backfield. Hand it off. The back breaking free. Mitchell is there for the tackle at the 29. Another big gain on first down. I'd be surprised to see this drive end in anything but a touchdown. This defense is just getting whipped out there. First Ball on the 29-yard line. Ball on the 29-yard line. Here we go, baby. With the carry, Carter comes up to make the play at the 23-yard line. Frazier runs it through the middle again of about six. On the play. Ball on the 23 yard line. Ball on the 23 yard line. Let's run, man. It's showtime, baby. Here we go, baby. Throwing. Jumps up and he has it. He's talking about great hands and great concentration. He showed all those things there and he knew where the sideline was to make the grab. They have to get it now to at least the 19 yard line. They line up in the I formation. Pressure. 
Great effort that time, John. He's clearly one of the best in the league. Yeah, he's one of those guys who's been playing for a while now. And let me tell you, he might never be better than he is right now. This is going to be about a 45-yard field goal attempt. The field goal attempt has now made four field goals. Not every drive is going to get you a touchdown, so getting three was big. Now they got to go over what worked and what didn't, so the next drive will get them a TD. He's just about ready to kick this one away. This one is handled by Mac. They'll head back onto the field looking to duplicate their last drive when they were able to get the ball into the end zone, basically through their passing game. So they have first and ten here. After 20 yards, first and ten. Chicago goes with a four-man front. Hand it off. Quick is there on the stop. They might not be busting off big games, but those linemen are really working hard down there. Ball on their own 21. Ball on the 21-yard line. Finley sends a man in motion. Hands it off. Quick is there for the tackle at the 25. They don't deviate at all from the last play call as they keep it on the ground. Third and five. Ball on the 25 yard line. The Bears come out in a nickel pack. Rowing. This one falls incomplete, and good pressure forced him to get rid of the pass early. Any way you look at it, an incomplete pass is a heck of a lot better than throwing it to the other guy. Offense couldn't get it done, and they'll line up to punt. Now you start to look around and you figure who are the go-to guys? The guys who can respond and get this game close again. So we've reached the end of the third quarter with the Ravens ahead of the Bears. 24. Here's a well. And we'll start the fourth quarter. It's first and ten. Ball on the 43 yard line. The Ravens come out in a nickel package. With the pass, comes up with it. Joyce comes up to make the play at the 49. Number 23 picks up about six after that catch. Second and four. Ball on the 49 yard line. The Ravens come out in a nickel package. Gets the pass off. Andrews is there on the stop at the 37-yard line. Perfect execution to get this first down. Look at it here. He knows how far they have to move the chain. And he gets it by making the right decision and laying it in there like that. Gets rid of it, and he dropped it. He did a nice job of getting off the line and getting into a fast pass. He had the ball bounce right off his fingertips. Second and ten. Ball on the 37-yard line. Let's do our thing. Let's do our thing. Hey, hey, hey. The Ravens line up in the quarter defense. 
Pressure coming with the throw. He hits his receiver. It's loose. The Ravens pick it up. Unbelievable. What a time to cough up the ball. So with the play in question, the coach has decided to challenge the court. Yeah, and they might get this call reversed. The coach is hoping to get it right here because that could be a big lift to the team. What the official will be looking for here is to see if the knee is down. It's tough to say with that replay. This one won't be easy. So the coach looks a lot smarter after getting the play reversed in his team's favor. It didn't hurt that the official had some great replays to look at. And they made it easy to overrule. Here we go, baby. Here we go, baby. On the ground. Great fake. On the run. Incomplete pass. Two in a row just dropped. The intended receiver on the play. Second and ten. Ball on the 26-yard line. So we're gonna take it. Let's go now. Forrest will work out of the shotgun. Gets rid of it. The wide receiver has it. Andrews comes up to make the play. At the eight. Perfect execution to get this first down. Look at it here. He knows how far they have to move the chain. And he gets it by making the right decision and laying it in there like that. in the end zone so the offense still has possession and that's the last thing you want as a defender to have the ball go right through your hands in the end zone it's second and goal at the eight yard line only one man in the backfield Doss moves in motion dropping back hit as he throws Incomplete. This guy is so strong, he was able to get that pass away. It's third and goal at the eight. Throwing. He's there. Touchdown, Bears. This is a good play by the offense in the red zone. The wide receiver is going to break away right here and come up with a catch and a touchdown. just tuning in this has really been a great game so far and with that touchdown only a few points separate these two teams and clearly this game is far from over John you're absolutely right Al these guys are clawing and scraping and now they're close enough to smell a victory good job by both the players and the coaches will be kicking off. Back, back and he got all of that one, a great kick. This one is handled by Mac. So they have first and ten here. At the 20 yard line. First and ten. Chicago goes with a four-man front. To carry. 
Orient. We're going to spot this one at the 29. So that tackle was his third. Gain of 10. Second and about one. Ball on the 29 yard line. The Bears with a four man front. Throws it. And it's caught. Now he has such a quick release. The ball was out before anybody knows what's happening. That makes it hard for him to be sacked, and it gives the defenders less time to react. First and ten. Ball on the 40 yard line. Let's go. Let's go. Chicago using three linebackers. For the counterplay. He's brought down behind the line for a short loss. Big tackle there for a loss and great pursuit there, John. You can say that again. He knows how to prepare, and it really pays off when you make stops like that. Ball on their own 38. Ball on the 38 yard line. Chicago goes to the four-man front. He gets the carry. Rowing. Almost picked off. In Williams with the coverage. Smith, the intended receiver on the play. Third and 12. Ball on the 38-yard line. Oh, this is tough for you. Chicago comes out with seven in the secondary. Under pressure, gets the pass off. It's going the other way. Now that was just a bad decision. Look at this. Two defenders right near the receiver. Now there are a few guys who think they can squeeze the ball into double coverage, and he's one of them. That time he gambled, and he lost. Ball on their own 44. Ball on the 44 yard line. Let's do our thing. Let's do our thing. It's up. They give it to the halfback. This one will be spotted at midfield. He was in on that play, giving him seven tackles so far in the game. Ball at midfield. Ball on the 50 yard line. He gets the count. Number 55 tackles him, but not before the first down is reached. He just barely finds his way past the marker. First and ten. Ball on the 46 yard line. Hey, score, score, score. Get it up. Nickelback in this time. On the ground. Frame. Comes up to make the play. Hall takes advantage of a little daylight, picks up three yards. Ball on the 43 yard line. Ball on the 43 yard line. Keep it up. shoot. Hand off to the tailback, runs him over. Joyce is there on the stop at the 34 yard line. Hey, if you can keep running the ball in the fourth quarter as you're playing catch-up, that's an advantage that you have over the defense because it keeps them off balance. This one at the 32 yard line. It's his third tackle of the contest. So a pickup of maybe three. It's second down and seven to go. We're talking about Brian. The Ravens come out of a nickel package. Gets rid of it. It's broken up. 
He's got great recovery speed. And he can catch up to the ball even if he's caught out of position. That time he was right there in the secondary to tip the ball away. Jones was the one they were trying to get the ball to. Third Eighth play of this drive. Ball on the 32-yard line. Danny, 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 Danny. The Ravens come out in a nickel pack. Drops back with the throw. And this pass is completed. They're going to spot this one at the 21-yard line. He stopped him there, and according to our numbers, that's tackle number six for him. comes up to make the play at the 17 yard line. Palmer busted through for a few tough yards. Ball on the 17 yard line. Tenth play of this drive. Almost at the two minute mark now. Last trip inside the 20 resulted in a touchdown and they need another one here to take the lead. Andrews was there on the cover. Two-minute warning coming up. Baltimore comes out in their nickel package with the pass. Look for the wide receiver. Lopez comes up to make the play at the eight-yard line. This is good communication between the quarterback and his receiver to keep the chains moving. They know where the first down marker is, and they recognize the type of coverage the defense is playing. The ball is there, and so is the catch. is there for the tackle at the four-yard line. Number 27 is being called upon to replace the injured corner. Hand it off. Gross comes up to make the play. Looks like they're going to go with a no huddle. Throws one up in the end zone. No choice here, John. They just have to keep throwing. Yeah, they do. Running the ball isn't going to do a whole lot of good now. Not a difficult decision. They're going to go for it. So off lob to the end zone. He's got it. Touchdown, Bears. Forrest with some very nice footwork in the pocket. And that touchdown pass gives his team the lead here in the fourth period. And they'll keep the kicker on the sideline as they attempt to make this a three point game. All on us, y'all. Give it to the halfback. They failed to get the two. This one is handled by Mack. You know, they only need a field goal, so the defense needs to make sure they don't fall asleep here. Simpson returns from being injured. Watch the man. Watch the snap down, Sam. 
Finley from the shotgun. Throws it. You know, as a receiver, you have to be aware of so many things. Where the first down marker is, where the defenders are, and where the sideline is as you stretch out to make that catch. Mack was the intended receiver on that play. So we have a challenge. The officials are going to review it. Whenever a questionable call happens in the last two minutes, the review is called from upstairs. It appeared he did a great job of keeping his balance along the sidelines. Yeah, and the only question is, did he step out? That's what I think they're looking for in the booth. The player was out of bounds when he caught the ball. Incomplete pass. So the referee agrees with the official upstairs, and this one has been overturned. Well, it was put in to right or wrong. And right there, it was wrong. And now it's right. Finley, back in the shotgun. With the throw, a little behind, but he has it. The Ravens call a timeout. They have one left. Number 85 makes the catch for a pickup of five on second down. Third it's third and down five. and five to Ball go. on the 25-yard line. Here we go, baby. Only one man back. Throws it. He finds his man. You know, when it's third and so many yards, why the heck would you run a pass pattern that was short of the first? Makes no sense to me. The rush is on. Gets rid of it. They go for it and don't make it. That was a conversion the offense needed. They have to be disappointed, and it's worse because now the other team has the ball. First and ten. Ball on the 27-yard line. No need for anything else but taking a knee here to finish this one out. Second and 12. Ball on the 29 yard line. Go make the play! A little misdirection. Williams comes up to make the play. Five yard game. He'll just take a knee. Stewart and the kicking team come on for this field goal attempt. Two minutes left, and they tack on three more points. Pat is just about ready to kick this one away. Whip kick here. A mistake by the kicker on that one. Penalties and takeaways can really kill a team. Usually the team with the fewest mistakes out there will win the game. First and ten. Ball on the 40 yard line. Let's go now. Need a half on that rail. The Bears come out in a dime packet. With the pass. Smith is there on the stop at the 45-yard line. And they hurry up to the line. Clear! Clear! Yeah, you see me. Let's go. Rowing. Whoa, 
Number 27 is there for the Tigers at the 17-yard line. Let's see how this defense handles the no huddle. The final score is Chicago 28, the Bears 4. 28, the Ravens 24. This game is presented by the authority of the National Football League and EA Sports. Any publication, rebroadcast, or other use of the descriptions and accounts of this game without the expressed written permission of EA Sports is prohibited. This is Al Michael.